Hey, what's up guys? I'm Sinus, and today I'm going to be doing a video on Piper Survival. So, we're not being joined by Junior today because he's off busy, but uh, I thought we should uh, get into some more slime fun. I'm going to show you the nuclear reactor and how to build it. So, if you start off, you need glass. So I'm going to make it like this. This is the best way to do it. A three by three. Uh, a 3x3 three three sphere of glass. Okay, so when that's done, just uh, break a hole in the middle and then fill it up with water. And then just place that block there and then fill it up. And then you've got a steady run of water. So. If you just pop out, and then you have this here. Okay, so you need a carbonodo edge and energy capacitor, but uh, not carbonodo, uh, carbonodo specifically. There's other ones. Uh, so if you look in your guide, the energy electricity. There's small, there's medium, there's big, there's large, and there's carbonodo. Carbonodo is obviously the best. It holds the most power. So you want to go into your nuclear, uh, into the glass place. Uh, just get a block and I'll just use uh, this quartz I got and then place the nuclear reactor here <clears throat> Okay, so uh, once you put that in there you can Access it by right clicking on it and you'll uh, this is the fuel slot as you see up here in here. This is uh, the, uh, the place where you put plutonium and um, this is the coolant slot. So the plutonium isn't necessary, but the coolant slot and the fuel slot is necessary. Okay guys, so make sure when you get the uranium, do you have the ha uh, hazmat suit on? So the hazmat suit, the, the helmet's called the scuba helmet, but the rest is called the hazmat suit. And it'll say in red, part of hazmat suit in the law. So all of that to make sure that you don't die from the uranium. Now I put it on because it gives me effects. Like it gives you effects like uh, nausea and all that stuff. So, and that's how it kills you. So put it on. And then you also need uh, reactor coolant cells, a freezer, and um, and uranium, and the energy regulator. So if I put in the uranium. And the coolant cell, and then I put a energy regulator here, and a freezer by here. As you can see, we have power by here. So if you just then top it off for there, you start to get power. You can. Uh, You could put uh, coolant cells in there. I'm not sure what you put in there. And um, <clears throat> you can also get a reactor access port at uh, the shop, which will let you, um, which will let you put the stuff that you put in the reactor in that instead. <clears throat> but yeah, that's basically how you make the nuclear reactor. Now, if you get the regulators and flush them. Like put them like flush with that and then just build it up and then put those next to machines that will fill up eventually and yeah so I hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching bye